Welcome back to 365 Ninja. Today we're going to go over how to use paste options in Word. Now I know personally that copying and pasting is one of my favorite functions within the Microsoft Office. The last thing I want to do is have to type out the text and recreate it new character by new character. Thankfully, there's a tool called Paste Options available in Office 365 that provides the option to paste up to your expectations. It's available in lots of Office 365 programs, but today we're going to go over how to paste an Excel table into a Word document and use Paste Options to make sure the table is formatted properly. So I've got my Word document here, and the button I'm actually going to press is up here in the left. You'll see that it's grayed out at the moment, which is because I don't have anything on my clipboard. So, let's head over to Excel and find some stuff to put on a clipboard. I'm going to copy a few columns. I only need to see item number through where purchase. So I'll leave the prices out for now. I'll copy, control C, switch back over to Word, and now you'll see that this icon has color to it. It's active because I have stuff on my clipboard. Now, instead of just pressing paste, I'm going to click this arrow here to see all my different paste options. So once you expand the menu, you can actually hover over all these icons below to see how you can paste it differently. So the first one, just paste it normally how we saw it in Excel. Use destination styles copies over the table, but it leaves out the formatting that's endemic to the Excel spreadsheet, such as the color. Link and keep source formatting is like the first one we saw, but you can also link it back to your Excel spreadsheet. So if you make changes in the Excel spreadsheet, they'll be linked and reflected in the Word document. Link and use destination styles is similar to before. It keeps the formatting for a Word, and then it also links back to Excel. There is an option for pictures, so it'll just snapshot whatever you copy on the Excel spreadsheet and snapshot it onto the Word document. And then you have the option to just keep the text only. For my intents and purposes, I'm going to select use destination styles. I don't need the extra colors or extra formatting that are specific to Excel. And all I need to know is the text. So I'll click this, and my information is pasted. Hope you found this tip helpful. For more tips and tricks, visit 365ninja.com.